Are you Mr. Barnaby? Detective Chief Inspector Barnaby, yes. Who are you? My name is Dennis. Dennis Rainbird. My card. Oh, you're an undertaker. Yes. I am based in Causton, but as it happens, I live here in Badger's Drift, and I thought I ought to pop by. Miss Simpson was a client. I'm sorry? She prepaid our satin service. It's one of our complete funeral packages. Very upmarket, although, between you and me, I let her have it at a discount. <laughs> she taught my mum, you know. Well, what can I do for you, Mr Rainbird? I was wondering if I could take her, the deceased. Oh, I'm afraid that won't be possible for a little while. Oh, so you do suspect some naughtiness. It was her neck, I understand. Who told you that? Oh, come on, everyone knows by now. It's that sort of village. Well, you can't have the body yet. All right? Sir? Oh. I see you've got a right constable there. You let me know when you're ready for me. See the car? Yes. You wouldn't have thought they were so well paid, would you? Undertakers. Check out that camera and the telephones. Find out what calls Miss Simpson made after six o'clock. So you're taking it seriously then, sir? No, Troy. Actually, I'm just filling in time till tea. Right. Oh, uh, camera and telephone, right. Uh, what about you? I must find the doctor. Something wrong, sir? Emily Simpson's doctor, Troy. Maybe she did suffer from dizzy spells. Maybe she did just fall. Either way, I want to know. No. Well, she never complained to me. She was remarkably fit for her age. When did you last see her, Dr. Lester? A couple of days ago. Well, I, I don't know. I, I liked to drop in at the end of my rounds. Um, you know, glass of sherry and all that. <laughs> you didn't talk to her at all in the last 24 hours? Uh, no. I was Wayne Causton all day yesterday. Local hospital. No, you weren't, Daddy. That was Tuesday. What? You go to Causton on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I'm just trying to be helpful. <laughs> yes. You're right. Uh, thank you, Judith. Of course, I was in all day yesterday. I was watching the cricket, a test match. You're not treating this as murder, are you, Inspector? We're not ruling anything out, Mrs. Lesseter. Well, I was in Corston all day yesterday, shopping. I like shopping. Ask Pookie. No need to follow my wife, Inspector. Just follow her credit card slips. God. Judy. I don't know what's the matter with her at the moment. It's that boy she's seeing. Yes. He's an artist, local chap. I can call her back if you like. No, that's all right. I take it Judy is your stepdaughter, Mrs. Lesseter. Yes. I'm Trevor's second wife. You know, I really don't know how we can help you, Inspector. Do you know anyone who might have had a grudge against Miss Simpson? Any reason to cause her harm? No. I mean, no one would want to hurt her. She didn't have an enemy in the world. Thank you.